It's Mother's Day and my wife requested lasagna. Let's make a homemade. Medium onion right here. Heating up for our lasagna noodles. We're gonna hit this with some graza olive oil. Onion, onion. Nights and translucent. We're gonna add in two pounds of ground beef. Two pounds. Up in here and just mash it up to the consistency that you like. Add quite a bit of Italian seasoning. A good dose of onion butter seasoning. If you don't have onion butter seasoning, you can use onion powder if you like. Just adds a little extra flavor. Add in the rest of our squeeze lick bottle. About two tablespoons if you're running low on squeeze lick. Quarter man's lunacy garlic hot sauce will do the trick. This right here will put hair on your peaches. Not optional, who's your sister sauce? Two tablespoons worth. I like Prego, a lot of you might not. If you want to use Reyes, I'm going with 45 ounces of sauce. You should make your own. Ah, shut up. A little water in the jar, give it some swish. Paid for the whole thing, you use the whole thing. Let this go on low and let it sit to get to know each other while we work on our pasta. This water to be salted, similar to the ocean. Noodles look about like that. If you're like me and thought lasagna just came in huge sheets, come in strips. Them to al dente. All righty, 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 righty. Ten minutos. Before we go work on our cheese filling, give us some UFO salt, extraterrestrial pepper, some swish, and a taste. Mamma mia! Going in with one pound of mozzarella. Give it some shred. Pro tip, one pound of cheese is equivalent to four cups. I love that cheese grater. I don't know why people talk so much trash about it. It's probably one of the best Amazon purchases I've made. If you need one for yourself, you can get it over in the link on my page. Whenever the pasta is done, get it out, get it in cool water as quick as possible so you can assemble your lasagna. Last one. I said it'll grow up over here. Two cups of ricotta cheese. Two cups of mozzarella. One egg, two cups of freshly shredded Parmesan cheese, the salts and peppers, heavy pepper, Italian seasoning, the mix. If you're a bigger dude trying to find some shirts, I did find the hookup from a company called Strong Side. That's the only logo they got on them. So if you like wearing plain shirts, not a lot of badging or big weird logos, Strong Side's makes all the way up in the big X's, know what I'm saying? If you look nice, maybe you'll have less X's in more ways than one. You never know. We're going for a mixture that looks somewhat like this right here. Give the bottoms a good spray down so nothing sticks. Now we can assemble. Meat sauce first, onion noodles. The way I figured it up, I can get three noodles wide. And with a dose of our cheese stuff, more meat and sauce over the top of that. What are you making? Lasagna. Lasagna? Yeah, it's Garfield's favorite food. I have lasagna? Well, yeah. Hooray! Sauce. Now that we've got our layers done, we're gonna come in here and we're gonna top it with our mozzarella Parmesan mixture. Spray the tin foil so it doesn't stick to the top of your cheese. Tossing this in the oven at 375 degrees for 35 minutes. And this one will get covered up and get froze for a later meal. Easy, just pop it in and go. We're gonna go uncovered, batter back in. 10 minutes. Just got back from church. We're gonna throw this up under the broiler with more cheese. Bag mozzarella right chair. You go edge to edge. Maximum spreadage, add it to the broiler, let's go. Ba, 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 ba. Lasagna. This was some dried parsley, real quick. No, no, no. Was the wife's plate now for mine? About to bust out the fine china. Some porcelain. So I did make some adjustments as I went with the recipe. So whatever it's down in the caption is the one you should use. It's the one I'm going to support. This looks absolutely phenomenal. That right there, wow. I didn't forget. Yeah, 